So today we have a lot of news about the S22, S20 Plus and the S22 Ultra. A new report from Sam Mobile has infos about the brightness levels of the Samsung Snakes high-end smartphones. Now here's the thing, the peak brightness is the highest level of brightness a display can reach in the auto mode. This is usually activated in mostly bright scenarios, like under the sun kind of scenarios. The Galaxy S21 has a standard and peak brightness of 1000 and 1300 nits respectively. Sadly, the S22 won't be any more brighter, so it's similar. On the other hand, the S22 Plus and the S22 Ultra's display will offer standard brightness level of 1200 nits and a peak brightness level of 1750 nits. That is insane amount. Now for context, the current S21 Ultra's display can reach up to 1500 nits, peak brightness. Even Leaker Ice Universe recently said the same thing, but he mentioned nothing about the S22 Plus, but, but now we know that. The S22 will reportedly feature a 6.06 inch display, the S22 Plus will have a 6.55 inch panel, and the Ultra will have a 6.8 inch display. Now all of them will feature centered punch hole with high refresh rate displays and razor thin bezels this time. That is just gonna be cherry on the top. The S22 and the S22 Plus will have a 1080p screen by the way, so if you are asking about that. The S22 Ultra will reportedly feature a quad camera array, the 108 megapixel main camera, which will be an improved version of the HM3 sensor, a 10 megapixel periscope teleporter unit with, with 10x optical zoom, but another 10 megapixel teleporter unit with 3x optical zoom, and then there will be a 12 megapixel ultra wide angle camera, plus few of the laser and all those stuff. Now, according to Leaker Ice Universe, there is an artificial intelligence powered image quality enhancement mode and it will result in better details, colors and brightness. And he also said that he has never seen those kind of details ever in an 108 megapixel shots. So yeah, he also has some photo evidence but he cannot share the samples at this moment. He also said that the S22 Ultra will have much less blurry and brighter photos in the night thanks to some anti-shaking features. That's cool. Many thanks to Let's Go Digital, we have seen tons of real life looking renders. That includes the S22 Ultra's green color one, that includes the pink colored S22 Plus and so much more. Now we have leaked press material of the Galaxy S22 series, an official press material. The copper color one may be the rumored burgundy red Galaxy S22 Ultra. While the white one next to it is either the S22 or S22 Plus, cause they both look identical. And yes, all of them will feature glass back this time, according to Ice Universe. So we don't have to worry about the build quality. So now the color options look like this. The Galaxy S22 and the S22 Plus will come in blue, gray, purple, beige, black, white, green, and rose gold. While the S22 Ultra will come in black, white, dark red, or copper or burgundy red, I don't know, and green. I love the green one. Let me know your favorite color in the comment section below. Even though the leak suggests that the pre-order date is 8th of February, the launch date is 18th of February, but now we are hearing that a significant supply chain issue leads to a revised Samsung Galaxy S22 release schedule. Now there is no exact detail available at this moment, but it could be the early days production issues or maybe even the global chip shortage, I don't know. So even though you may be able to pre-order them on 8th of February, but you might have to wait to get it on your hands. So yeah. And yeah, check out my website on your computer, tablet or your phone. Join the avid.com, link down below. It's for everything tech. You're gonna get all these and more tech news way faster than these videos. These videos take a lot more time and effort to create. So subscribe to this channel and like this video as I appreciate that and definitely visit my website.